A controversial exhibit is opening this weekend at the Geffen Museum in Little Tokyo. You may call it graffiti. Some people call it street art. Cake Outline's Amy Murphy shows us what's on display. Los Angeles street artist Saber says he's waited 21 years for this day. This is once in a lifetime opportunity for us to be recognized as a major art movement. Um, a lot of people contest what we do is vandalism or is art. Um, this time we let the work speak for itself. A four month prestigious exhibition of street art from all over the world. Artists and VIPs got a preview. It really affects the everyday person walking past the road that's going to be confronted with a topic, an image, or something that's going to make them think. And that's the role of art. A tribute to Blade, along with installations from Mr. Cartoon and Banksy, just to name a few. Street art has this, it's this whole new culture and it's coming up and for them to get this kind of recognition for something that's like, you know, vandalism specifically. The exhibition also differentiates between tagging and gang activity. In a small corner of the exhibition, Greg Batman Davis, one of the founding members of the L.A. Crips. We're marking the territory. When you when you see Crip on the wall, that's to let you know you're in Crip's neighborhood. Something both Batman and Saber say is no way representative of street art. It, it gets misinterpreted to a certain degree, and we get lumped in with the, the gang activity and things when, in fact, um, it's about the art. It's about the culture. So if you see a kid who's marking a surface, he could be doing something else. He's actually trying to participate in the creative spirit. In Little Tokyo, Amy Murphy, KKL 9 News. The Art in the Streets exhibit at the Geffen Contemporary Museum opens to the public Sunday and it continues through August 8th.